Hi, fourth grade, and this is Bilger here with your reading lesson for Thursday. Uh, you guys did a great job interpreting and analyzing characters in the story Beagle. I really hope you enjoyed that short story. I also hope you had some fun trying to figure out the moral of that story or the theme of that story. Um, we're going to continue that work today and build upon what you did with Beagle yesterday. So continuing to talk about theme, okay, so we still are doing that work today. Today we are just looking at interpreting that theme and life lessons of the story and how to go about doing that and what that may look like, what that may sound like. So readers, today I want to remind you that when readers interpret themes and life lessons of stories, they continue to use the character to analyze, analyze both the character, the setting, the plot, other story elements, as well as the theme, and then pulling out a life lesson or moral that you can apply to your life. So when we think about doing that, um, we've already done some of this work uh, with what we wrote yesterday, so we want to continue to think about that. To do this, name the life lesson and give that text evidence. So that's what you've done with Beagle and what we did yesterday with Little Willie. So today to kind of continue that interpretation, we're going to add a little bit. So continuing, we can state the theme, give those details, but then we also want to unpack that text evidence. Really analyze the text evidence piece, not just analyzing the character anymore. We want to put it all together. So what that may look like, what that may sound like, when you talk about life lessons and you talk about themes, they can sound like you should always, you should never, remember to, in life it's important to. So those are some examples. When you think about text evidence, um, the text evidence can sound like when you're writing or when you're reading uh, because the text says in the text according to the story, for example, or for instance. So thinking about those pieces and thinking about unpacking that text evidence, this is also what you could use to set and start or what it may look like and sound like. This shows that, this proves that, as you can see. So to unpack what we wrote about yesterday, we did um, that work with Stone Fox and Little Willie. So here's what we wrote yesterday. We talked about our theme, that we decided upon in the story Stone Fox. We talked uh, not only about the theme, we also stated a character trait of Little Willie, which is what we talked about this week as well. And then we gave that text evidence. So the theme in Stone Fox is never give up and persevere. Little Willie is determined. According to the story, he continues to harvest crops. When he realizes he still needs more money to keep the farm, he enters the dog sled race. So we have that text evidence there. Everything after according to the story, that was our sentence starter for our text evidence. Um, everything after that, we kind of wanna unpack that. We wanna interpret it to try to understand it and apply it to our life or how may it apply to our life or Little Willie's wife. So I'm going to use the sentence starter. This shows It is important to never give up and persevere. So we've already stated all of these things. None of these are new thoughts at this point. It's just getting us started. This shows was our sentence starter. We already stated what our themes were. Okay, so the beginning of our sentence is just restating what we already know. So continuing that conversation, now we're just going to unpack it. And a great word to do so is because. Because explains that why. Because you always want to grow. person and be the best you can be. Okay, so Little Willie shows us all these things, right? Through him not giving up and him persevering, he shows us that he wants to grow as a person and really be the best he can be in order to save the farm. 
But because he wants to do that, he's still growing as a person and becoming the best version of himself. So that's a great moral, great life lesson that we can really take from this story. So just to unpack this a little bit again, I want to go back to our post-it and I want to kind of underline and highlight the things that we did to make sure we checked off all the boxes. So state the theme. That was one of the things that they wanted us to do. So I say that the theme and then I can circle what I said my themes were. Great, I did that. So I give details from across the text. So everything that was after according to the story are my text is my text evidence. He continues to harvest the crops. Great, that's one example when he realizes he still needs more money. To keep the farm, he enters the dog race. Great, two text evidences that we can use to support our theme. And then unpacking that text evidence. What does that mean? What does that what does that um, determination, perseverance, and never giving up really mean. So I use my sentence starter, this shows. It is important. I'm just restating my theme. And then I'm giving the why. So this shows it is important to never give up and persevere because you always want to grow as a person and be the best that you can be or the best version of yourself. So a great life lesson that anybody can apply to their life in this story. So we've interpreted that theme to hopefully be able to apply it to either our lives or somebody else to apply to their life or even to, to little Willie's wife life. So today and every day readers, as you continue to read and analyze your story, make sure you're constantly analyzing your character, you're understanding all elements of the story, and through doing that work, you're able to interpret themes and life lessons of stories and unpack that text evidence. Have a great reading lesson today. Off you go.